you just say Stop. just pick one? Jack, come on, I'm covered in triplets. Can I help you, Rebecca? I'm waiting for someone. I love our life. I love it right now. Because the truth is, when I close my eyes and I think about our future, I see us with kids. There's nothing wrong with me focusing on my career, you know? You mean the singing? Yeah. I mean the singing. Maybe it's because I'm still singing at Froggies. And I'm not as far along as I thought I would be. I don't know. It's over, Ben. It's... It's all over. What would you guys say if I told you you were having twins? I'd say you're lying. Yeah. <laughs> I am. Oh, okay. <laughs> you're having triplets. Get raised three children in a two-bedroom walk-up. <laughs> you have a home. You have a home. No, 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 no! Please don't tell me that I'm gonna die on my way to a Weird Al Yankovic concert. Bring a girlfriend if you know that she hates me. You constantly criticize my family. I am not a good enough cook. I don't clean well enough. Uh, Jack doesn't provide. You get the hell out of my house. When the snow is gone, get the hell out of my house. I want you gone too. Because I will not expose Randall to any more of this crap. Go and say it out loud that you're lying. I have no life. I have zero life, Jack. I am a housewife to three teenagers who do not need me anymore. And I have a husband who waltzes in every night at 8 o'clock, if I'm lucky, goes to the kitchen, recaps his day for me, and then passes out upstairs at 10 o'clock. I have no life. I am a friggin' ghost! No! No! Continued minor incidents of memory loss. Things could begin to deteriorate. There is a chance that over time we'll experience more difficulty. I need you all to hear my voice right now. Your mother's voice with all of her faculties. I just, I can't. He knew how to do all of this. He was fearless. I'm not fearless. I'm not. Super Bowl! Oh, yes, I love you! Hey, talk, talk, talk. Oh, yes. oh, they're in so much trouble! It's so strange, isn't it? And I am your wife. And if you have a problem, we will fix it together. How just like that, a complete stranger can become such a big part of your story. Make the big moves, even if they're small moves. Forge ahead with your lives in any and every direction that moves you. And I'm asking you to be fearless. You know, it's so strange. Hmm. I'm not worried about forgetting about the big stuff. I will love you today and every day for the rest of my life. It's the little things. It's the... It's the regular Saturday when the kids were little. It's me. That day when nothing big really happens. <laughs> we were just there, normal family. That's the stuff I'm not ready to let go of yet. Super Bowl Sunday! Hey, Beth? Huh? Mrs. Pearson, your husband has died. Strong for them. You know neither of you has to be the man of the house now, right? You will not make your life smaller because of me. That you don't have 
to worry about me, okay? Ever. You are the same woman who lost a child and rolled out of my hospital with three babies just the same. And as tough as they come, I got the person. They did diagnose me with something called mild cognitive impairment, which could eventually yeah. lead to dementia or Alzheimer's. You survived. You survived just to lose a child. And then a husband. Look at him, man. And still, what a thing you made of it all. My life has been full of the next time. Now I realize that I am running out of time to do them. I want to spend however many good years I have left with my family. I know it's a struggle for me to get out of bed every morning. And I know that isn't fair to you guys, but... I can't... seem to stop it. I did what I could. I want to make up for all of my next times. My favorite person. Where is Miguel? My mother was magic. This is quite sad, isn't it? Today's gonna end no matter what. The end? I've always felt it a bit lazy to just think of the world as sad. Because so much of it is. Because everything ends. Everything dies. But if you step back, you'll see that the end is not sad. It's just the start of the next incredibly beautiful thing. Hey.